When you meet the Luna sisters of Sedgwick, you feel like you've known these people all your life. Well, tonight, they fix us dinner. Tonight, we are privileged to sit at their table. If you're hungry, come on inside. We've made a lot of Mexican food. Come on. The Luna sisters aren't <laughs> kidding. Their food is legendary. Uh, just follow us. There is more than fire that keeps this house cozy. If they're too white, they're scared. <laughs> and if they're too dark, they're burned. <laughs> it's these sisters who never met a stranger. I'm in India. I'm Manuela. I'm Mikaela. And this is their wood stone. It belonged to their mother, and the daughters have kept the tradition. I think that's what it is. It means everything. It reminds of a, a mother cooking on here and us learning how to cook with her. This was a pretty round one. They don't always come out this way. <laughs> In this tiny kitchen, in this small Sedgwick home, the Luna sisters are cooking up traditions and love as they prepare their Mexican dishes. We don't use it real often in the, in the summer. They fired up this old wood stove on one of the hottest days of the year, just for me. Now, friends ask them why they don't get a new one. And I said, no, I said, I don't think so. Because if we didn't have the wood stove, Larry Hadberg wouldn't, wouldn't be coming in the machine lab. <laughs> they sweat. They work. This little kitchen, it's home to memories, smiles, and tears, and continues to pull these sisters together in ways the rich will never understand. We can tell each other what we want, we feel. <laughs> and believe me, they do. <laughs> Each other, we don't stay bad very long. <laughs> this colorful food dares the taste buds, and they aren't disappointed. There is fire in this home, both in the kitchen and in the heart. These are gifts which we are about to receive from thy bounty through Christ our Lord. Amen. In these days of complicated lives, just seeing an old stovepipe reaching for the ceiling or an aging porcelain coffee pot, and then and then you feel the heat of real lives, and you know the work is always worth it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's right, it was so good, and we sweated, we cooked, we laughed, and we ate too much. The Luna sisters teach us that it isn't money that makes memories. That old wood stove and that little kitchen, the conversations that have taken place there are priceless. Mm.